Morning class, these are diapers. You're gonna to wanna to put those on because when I tell you about this game, you are gonna shit your pants. This is Watch Dogs Legion. London has fallen and it's up to you to take it back. There are nearly nine million characters out there and every single one of them is playable. Shit your pants. That's right. What about non-playable characters? NPCs, not worried about those. Okay, this game we're gonna focus on A, P, C. All playable characters where every C can be peed. So say I wanted to recruit a florist to choke a corrupt police officer with his own entrails. Could I do that? Sorry, are you, uh, are you in the right class? Yeah, I'm Barb. I'm a big Watch Dogs fan. I just didn't know that you could play all the characters oh, in You it. can, because you can be like a bartender, a bus driver, a hooligan. If you like, can walk up to them, you can become them. Uh, I'm sorry, do you have a video game instructor credential? I, I, I don't. Uh, no, I, I, no, you don't. All right, now, I asked some of you to complete missions last night. Let's hear about those. Aiden, now you can talk. Okay. I know, you're so excited. All right, let's hear about your mission. I had to take out this enemy general who was like holed up in this heavily like fortified compound. And so I recruited this awesome badass hacker named Victoria to take them out. And I also had like a spider bot as backup. And then we took over one of the Sentinel drones and then I just rode out on a drone and dropped a payload from above. It was awesome. Hold on a second. So you're, you're telling me that you were able to control not only a drone, but spider bots as well at the same time? Really? Well, the spider bots uh, are AI, so they just kind of control no, themselves. No, the spider bots are AI, so they just kind of control themselves. Yeah, you beat the bad guy. Whee! You're cocky. Everyone knows it. See me after class. All right, Barb, let's get a little maturity back in the room. Let's hear about your mission. Sure, okay. Well, I recruited this sharp-dressed college professor for an infiltration mission who just happened to be a former MI6 agent, and I'll tell you what, it was a godforsaken bloodbath. I mean, I opened up these fucking fascists like, like sardines, you know? Yeah, I took out a bunch of armed guards, and then I went hand-to-hand -hand with a Glock 19, and I shattered this fellow's clavicle, and I broke his arm, and then I turned to his friend, and I unloaded a full clip into his pelvis. They were both like ground beef by the end of it. Uh, Barb, I gotta tell you, that... I got my blood pumping. Oh, really? <laughs> really. Really? Really. 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 Uh, anyway, sorry. Uh, Todd, mm. you're next. Okay, so uh, I recruited this old chick named Ethel, and I stole this big-ass red bus to do this getaway mission, but then I was getting chased and I got stuck in an alley. Todd, there's a ton of incredible cars in this game. There's fast cars, you've got souped-up smart cars that have autopilot mode. Why the hell are you getting a bus for a getaway mission? Well, I didn't know how many people needed to get away. I tried to move it with a grenade launcher, but I blew it up accidentally. And I blew up Ethel, too. Yeah, well, we can see what you did, Todd. And, uh, well, she is gone forever. Doesn't she just respawn in the load screen? Anyone is playable. But that also means they are all dieable. As in permadeath. As in she is gone. As in you killed her. But Ethel had a family. Yeah, she had a family, but she doesn't anymore because she is dead because of you. And that is now for you to deal with for the rest of your life. Okay, everybody, that's class. That's all for today. Next week is a, a group lesson. We're gonna do co-op gameplay. Co-op gameplay, any questions about that? Am I going to jail? Maybe, you might. Okay guys, great session. For extra credit, I want you to watch the gameplay walkthrough.